All right, in this video, we want to talk about how to be able to enable videos on your Google Chrome. And you might be getting this error, couldn't load plugin or a different version of uh, Adobe Flash Player uh, not being able to load. And um, this could happen while you're trying to watch YouTube videos or Hulu, or someone might have sent you a video, or um, it could be like a weather app or just anything like that. So I want to show you here real quickly how to enable that um, and make it stop doing this error. The reason it's doing it is because ultimately what ha what's happening is you have two different uh, players, flash players that's going on at the same time. And this happens more with Google Chrome, the browser, than any, than any other browser. From here, what you want to do is make sure you're at Google on Google Chrome and you want to go all the way to the upper right part of the screen where you see these two lines it'll say customize and control Google Chrome the older versions of Chrome will have like a little wrench so of course you click it you scroll down until you see tools or more tools and then you go to the left and you choose task manager it's the exact same kind of ta task manager for like you know your Windows operating system um, when you want to end something like if something is freezing up you can do you know control alt delete and in a in a particular task that's freezing like a browser so what you're going to do is you want to scroll all the way down to the bottom and you're going to see something that says to the effect it'll say shockwave adobe flash or uh, usually it'll probably say shockwave um, and what you want to do is you want to select it now the reason it's not on mine is because mine has been uh, the process has been ended, uh, and that's the reason I'm not having problems with uh, downloading or you know watching videos. So you click it, and then you choose in process. That's going to disable Shockwave that is uh, disrupting the um, the plugin that you originally had that actually will be working. So you're not hurting anything or you're not disabling something that you need and you end process and that's it and you refresh your browser and it should work just fine you could restart your computer but I don't think you'll need to do that and hope that fixed your problem alright thanks for watching